Good morning and welcome to our weekly question time. We've got our star of the week and our superhero of the week. Morning guys, and what class are you in? The Badgers Year 2. The Year 2 Badgers. And what's your favourite thing about being in the Badgers? Mm. What do you like the best? Going inside the school. Oh, we've got two answers straight away then. We'll go with the superhero. What do you like the best? Going in Forest School. Forest School. Well, you're lucky we're having this interview in Forest School today, aren't we? What do you like best about Forest School? Seeing the chickens in the quad. Seeing the chickens in the quad. Well, they're being a bit quiet now, aren't they? Just as we were coming out, they were squawking away. <laughs> they must know they're being filmed. Yeah. Being quiet. And what's your favourite thing? Did you say science? Ooh, yeah. what do you like about science? Um, the learning about animals. Ah, fantastic. What's your favourite thing to learn about animals? Um, uh, what they need to survive. Ah, very good. And what animal have we been learning about this week? Sloth. The sloth. Can you tell me an interesting fact about a sloth? Um, uh, they don't need much food because they move very slow. Yeah, they don't need the energy, do they? Can you remember any facts about sloths from science? They drink water out of the... Um... They do. Well done, guys. Right then. If you were the Prime Minister of the country, so the boss, what would you make everybody do? <laughs> so you can make all the grown-ups and all the children do whatever you want. <laughs> what are you thinking? I make everyone come into school and, and, and if they find any chickens, more chickens, put them in there. So everyone's got to bring their chickens here. We'd be a chicken school. Yeah, I like chickens. Would turn into a farm or something, there'd be eggs everywhere. Yeah, and also piglets. And piglets? Chickens and pigs? Yeah, piglets. <laughs> Just piglets. Put, why don't we put them in there? What, with the other chickens? Yeah. We could do. Just fill it with chickens. Chickens and piglets. Chickens and piglets, of course. Yeah. Would we have them in the same pen together? No. And I think the um, chickens will go in that little tiny area. Okay. Down there, mm -hmm. and then the pigs have more space. Oh, maybe. But we'll move that to near there. Shall we show the viewers the chickens so they can see what you're talking about? Yeah. Okay. Go. There are the chickens. I'm mean, noisy now. <laughs> Love lifting one leg up for some reason. Probably because I want to see how good they are at bouncing. Yeah. Like There's another view. <laughs> So, what would you like if you were the Prime Minister? <laughs> what would you make everybody do? I would make everybody... squeeze in one house. Everyone in one house? It would have to be a giant <laughs> house. In, in, the man in a mansion. What? Yeah. Everybody in the country in one house? Yeah, yeah. in a mansion. In a mansion. And It'd have to be hundreds and day. thousands That's of good. mansions. Yeah, ah, so get all your friends yeah. in one house. Yeah. And then the gro all the grown-ups in another house. Oh. Which is really small. So so <laughs> you'd squeeze the adults into a small house and the do. children would have a mansion? Yeah. yeah. We can do whatever our we want them jump on the bed and everything. We can go oh, like a word. boy. I like your thinking. <laughs> Very good. Oh, okay, well, question yeah. number four then, guys. What makes you happy? Anything in the world, what makes you happy? Lollipops. Lollipops. What's your favourite flavour, lollipop? Uh, all of them. All of them? Yeah. You're not fussed? Just any lollipop will do. Any What's a smile lollipop. on your face? Fantastic. What about you? What makes you happy? Eating ice cream on a cold day inside. Eating ice cream on a cold day inside? Yeah. Okay. <laughs> Fair enough, if that's what makes you happy. What's your favourite flavour? Or do you just like lots of ice creams? Lots of ice creams. Yeah, good yeah. choice. Okay then, if you had one million pound, what would you go and buy? I All that money. Buy, uh, a farm and a mansion. A farm and a mansion? Yes. So I can see all the animals. So you'd have more than just chickens and piglets? Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> and only the chickens and piglets go in here, okay. and I'll have some as well. Fantastic. I'll pick your chickens. What? Mm -hmm. I like our chickens living here, thank you very much. 
then I'll take them to my farm, then I'll give you lots of chickens. I'll mm. give you two ones that look like the same. So you really, really want them chickens, don't you? Yeah. <laughs> and that coop. And that chicken coop. It is a big coop, isn't it? Pretty much everything you can see. Yeah. You just buy everything in the forest school. Yeah. And what about you? For a million pounds, what are you buying? Uh, probably a mansion and a Lamborghini. A Lamborghini? Uh, what colour Lamborghini? Green. You also want a Lamborghini. Yeah. His is green. What colour is yours going to be? Pink. Pink. Mm -hmm. Why do you want a Lamborghini? Are you old enough to drive? And I'm old, when I'm old enough. All right. On mine, I'm also going to have eyelashes and a fluffy steering wheel and chairs. So a pink Lamborghini that's got eyelashes, fluffy chairs and, did you say a fluffy steering wheel? Yeah. Strange, and, strange car. And my nan and my granddad, when I'm driving, I'm gonna, they're going to be getting the eyelashes and blinking them. I'm very strange. What about your green Lamborghini? Anything different about that? Um, I'm going to spray paint this. Yeah. So you're going to make it look cool? Uh, I watched this YouTuber where they they have this symbol on the top. All right. Like, why do I put it on the Lamborghini? Good idea. Right, question number six then, guys. If you had one superpower, what power would it be? I'm going to let the two of you answer this one first. I already know. Go on then, what power would you like? Hmm. <laughs> Making everyone in the school turn into chickens. <laughs> Are you obsessed with chickens by any chance? <laughs> yep, and piglets. And also... <laughs> I think mean, I mean, you can bet the, the, the school turned into a chicken farm and a, or just a farm. Probably turn the school into a big chicken coop. Yeah, and then all of the classrooms, I'll take all of the things out of them and put chicken things in them. And then every day I come to this school, it will be a chicken place. That's one of the strangest superpowers I'll, I've ever heard in my life. And I'll change the sign to chicken school. <laughs> and then they can learn things. Fair enough. So you'd be able to teach chickens? Yeah. How very strange. What about you? What superpower are you going for? Uh, heat vision. Pardon? Heat vision. heat vision. What would you do with heat vision? Um, somebody could just bring me some food and go... So you could up. warm up your food? <laughs> yeah. So you're using a microwave or a cooker? Oh. No, that takes too much time. Oh, so your, you just want that superpower you know to warm up your you food? Your yeah, and, and, to, and just to get kill a chicken <gasps> and get some meat. <laughs> He's yeah. going to cook your chickens. And then lock the thing so that you can... And you need a password and he won't know the password. Yeah, but I could just shoot my laser through them little No, holes. but I'll make it... Um, I'll make it so that you can't. I could just burn the lot. I'm just glad neither if of you, you two have got a superpower. Because I don't want chickens overrunning the place. <laughs> and I don't want you cooking them either. So I'm glad you've not got those powers, to be honest. I've got one more question then, guys. If you could take somebody from a cartoon and make them your teacher, who would you pick? Hmm. I would pick... Bart. Bart Simpson? Yeah. Ooh, that's a I cool one. Bart. I watch Simpsons is as well. A chicken? No, he's not a chicken. Oh, hmm. What else? What kind of teens are a chicken? Oh, I just reminded him. Yeah, that's that. your fault. We were going to have Bart, <laughs> Bart Simpson as a teacher. Yeah. Now we've got chickens coming to teachers. <laughs> that's all on you, that one. Two, two of them. I'll have two teachers. Bart Simpson Bart and a cartoon Simpson. chicken. <laughs> cartoon chi chicken, what name is? Bob. <laughs> Is that Mr. Bob or just Bob? Bob. Bob. Sir Bob, the chicken teacher. And Bart is going to be named something else. Barbie. 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 <laughs> Who are you picking? I'm just going to leave her answers right there. Go no further with them. Who are you picking? And Bart Simpson's name is going to be Chicken Coop. I wouldn't expect any different. How strange. And what about you? What cartoon in teacher? Uh, what cartoon character is your teacher going to be? You don't have to sing the answer, you could just give me a normal answer. I want to choose tree trunk. Tree trunk? Tree trunk? Is that because you just looked at a tree? You guys will go to King Carol walking into a tree and go a ball. Well, I'm just glad I'm not going to any of your two schools. I don't want to be taught by a tree trunk 
<laughs> or a cartoon chicken or Bart Simpson? No. Chicken coop. Oh, a chicken coop. <laughs> so, on that note, one last thing to do. Give these viewers at home a big wave and say goodbye. Bye-bye.